out there and welcome to English Teacher Plays. We're here with SkyFi. Now, this game is made by Back to Basics Gaming and uh, the last game we played, uh, published by them was Feminazi 3000, which was excellent. So here we are at the start of this game and half of the message here is cut off on either side of the screen. No idea why. Um, so we're just going to, we're going to, Assume that this is intentional and we're going to read it how it says. Me to the beta version of SkyFi, please remember eta version and you may find some errors. If yo, them feel free to report them to us and help the development. Cool. And then it's in Spanish as well. Um, let's press space and we'll get some loading going on. So... Um, I did have a look. I noticed it's published by Back to Basics Gaming. However, it is not uh, developed by them. It's... Oh, hold on. Sorry. I'm just... It's very loud. So I'm going to turn it down. Hopefully that's a little bit less loud. I'm going to turn it down for you guys as well. So you can hear me because someone rightly pointed out that occasionally when the games are like really noisy... Um, I do that headphone yelling thing and I don't want to do that. I don't want you guys to think I'm yelling at you because that's not what I'm here to do. So, um, let's see if we can fix the, uh, blend weight. One bone. Okay. Um, let's get some better resolutions going. Oh, sweet. It'll go all the way up to, uh, great. Love it. All right, well, let's um, let's play, I guess. Play. 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 Okay, there we go. We're playing. We're going to play on the Frosty Plains. And I'm pretty sure that's like the Eskimo, ice, you know, the Eskimo pie, the, the ice cream thing with the chocolate. I'm pretty sure that's that font. So, I don't know, man. I don't know. But at least we've got the widescreen now. So, oh, we got to press space. Um, sweet. It wasn't all up in my face, so I didn't see it. But I'm ready. I'm ready to play some SkyFi. I have no ill-conceived notions about it. All right. Uh, okay. Right. Uh, so, okay, I'm doing the things, I guess. Right. So it's pretty, um, it's pretty chill with this, uh, with this beat going on. Oh, there's the edge of the map. I mean, I, I don't know what the actual uh, deal is, but we're gonna, we're gonna hit these things. It seems pretty obvious that we're supposed to hit these things. Can we rotate? Oh yeah, we can. There we go. Q and E will let us rotate, so that's cool. This is the sort of game where I would expect a controller to be a little bit more satisfying. Just gonna turn it down a little bit more. <sighs> because it's always it's always louder than it looks on my levels. Um, which is which is frustrating. Well, there's a house there. I might come back and wreck into that house. It says turbulence is detected, but there's no no real turbulence, you know? We're just sort of flying. I will admit the flying, um... The flying's not bad. I, uh... You know? I'm, I'm not feeling as if I'm being too hard done by. Is that where I've been before? Oh, cool. Let's find, uh, the next thing. All right. It's, it must be behind this mountain, because I already got that one. Oh, no. I just went past it. Right. I don't know how to slow down, though. Oh, oh, we nearly died. Oh, oh, where is it? Oh, well, I missed it. That's fine. Let's go get the ones we can see. Woo! I mean... Yeah. There's no, like, feedback or anything in the game... There's no sound or anything. We're just listening to the, you know, to the chill, chill 
music. That's it. You know, we got 13 out of 14. Um, all right, there's another one there. Let's go get that. Um, yeah, but there's no, like, engine sounds or anything. You know, I don't feel like I'm flying, really. 14 out of 14. Okay, we won. Right. We won. That was a uh, victory for us. Go team. Team. To the E, to the A, to the M. Team. There's no I in team. I have to press space. <laughs> oh man, it's all the way down there in the bottom right corner. That's fine. It is what it is. All right. Oh, we've got a different plane this time. Well, let's have it, I guess. So after my uh, after my sound trouncing in my comment section about uh, my yelling and stuff, I just wanted to make sure. If you see me looking over to the left, it's just to make sure that my my levels are okay and that everything sounds okay and it looks okay and all that, you know, because I don't want you guys to be getting yelled at. Um. <sighs> yep. I mean, I turned the volume on my mic down a little bit, cause yeah, I was hitting, I was hitting like the the big decibels, and we don't want to do that. Oh, we've got a mini map, but it's it like moves with your guy, so. Oh, we can turn it upside down. Nice. Oh, but it auto corrects. Okay, that's fine. I kind of want to crash and see if I can. Um. I mean, I'm gonna grab a couple screenies here. I have definitely played way worse games than this. Um, that being said, I've definitely played way better games than this as well. All right. So if you go off the map, they just restart you. That's good. Good to know. Thanks, game. Love it. Yep. And I don't want to go off the map because I don't feel like restarting. Hey, they're flying a Confederate flag. That's not okay. That's not all good. I'm not down with celebrating the second place uh, team in the Civil War. Not okay. Yeah. And boom. Oh, we take off from the Confederate flag. I see. <laughs> Right. So we're... Apparently we're a, uh... We're down with the Confederacy and don't tread on me stuff. Apparently we are totally down with it. I wanna... I wanna swoop in there and get some good screenies of that. Oh, what's going on? Why did I... I don't, I don't know why I blacked out there. That, that was weird. Like, I don't, I don't know what I did. Did I just run into the sun or something? Um, let's go back. Where is it? There we go. And bang. Oh, we hit the we hit the tree. Oh, nose. Sky-Fi. I hit the tree. I'm sorry, Sky-Fi. Perhaps you'd like me to do uh, a dissertation or something about how the South totally could have won. <laughs> yeah, I'm really not sure. You know, maybe they just found like a stock asset and it was those flags. I mean, that, it wouldn't be unheard of. It is an unfortunate choice of flags, given the complete lack of context for it. I mean, if the game was about that or something, I don't know, man. I don't know. It's, it's, just, it's just so out of kilter with anything else. Right, so we won. Good job, team. We won. Sandy Fly, press space. I know how to do it now. I'm onto it. All right, come on. Come on. Load it up. We've got some more music. It's very cheery. Right. Okay. Okay. Uh, I'm feeling it.
Oh, that's a weird, that's a weird noise. We only need 11. So let's just get this one here as well. Ah! Right. So this is a bigger map. I do like how your, um, where you've been is, it like stays there. Whoops. <laughs> Bad. There we go. Let's go. Oh, I missed it. Oh, nope. That's fine. Well, I won't miss it this time. Get up there. Oh, oh, no, I survived. Yes, just like a real airplane. I kind of want to land and go running around in here, actually. Just to see the nothing that there almost inevitably is. But, you know, there's a few towns and stuff. It's more populated than some games. Yeah, there we go. Where's this one? Oh, we already flew past it. Okay, we gotta go back. There's only three more that we need to get. Now oh, we can see them. Nice. It's good that they stick out against the darkness like that. Love it. And one. And two. And there was a third one here. Yep. I want to get it in crash. Ah! Ah! And now what? We win. Happy forest. Nice. Love it. I don't love it. The game's the game's okay though. I think it only costs like three bucks. There are definitely worse ways of spending three bucks. I'll I'll admit that. Um, than listening to some chill music, and uh, why why is there turbulence detected though? Whoa. Um, the maps are too small. That would be my, uh, that would be my main complaint about the, uh, about the game. The maps are way too small. Um, for the fact that you want us to fly around and stuff. Whoops, missed that one. Um, yeah, I, I feel like you've taken what could be, like, quite a good experience and found it inside of a very small map that feels exceedingly restricting given the speed at which we fly, you know? Um, I mean, that's just me, man. That's just me. You know, other people might find this to be quite large, but I do not. You know? But that's fine. That's fine. So that would be my, that would be my main argument at the moment would be the, um, the size of the map. Oops, missed that. Yeah, I mean the music's nice and chill. The game is chill. Like I said, I can. I, there are tons of games that are way more stressful than this, that I would say are worse. Um, you know, I'm down for a chill experience. Oh, see, we died there, but I really shouldn't have. You know, I, that's pretty frustrating game. And then the takeoff zone for this game is like right into a wall. So then I feel like it's not my fault, you know? It's not my fault for going into the wall. All right, let's get this one this time. Yep, and dunk. 13, we need two more. Two more of these bad boys. There's one. We'll go there and get him. And dunk. And then we just need one more. Um, nope. There's the one here. There's one. There must be one this way somewhere. Come on, give me another one. Where are they? Why can't I see any? No, nope, they keep going underneath me or something. Oops. Yeah, I was looking at the mini map because there's no other way to see the um the thingies. Uh. Yep, I am not doing well here. I just need one more. I guess I've gotten the obvious ones already. 
Okay. Where are they? No, see, now we've flown past them. Right. No, I'm still not seeing them. There's gotta be one more, right? Maybe it's higher. Let's go higher. How high can we go before the, the game kills us? Ooh, the sound has definitely changed. Oh! Ah, no, there we go. We hit the, we hit the edge. There we go. Okay, well, I'm not able to see what it wants me to get at. Um, I can see the red things on the map, but I'm not seeing them anywhere. I'm not seeing them in the grass or in the sky. So... They, you know, they're pretty obvious things. So the fact that I'm not seeing them tells me that they don't exist. Oh, I can see one. I found one. Nice. And bangerang. Who's the best at Happy Forest? This guy's the best at Happy Forest. Okay, Red Forest. Um, we'll have a look, but then we'll go look at the description. Hopefully I haven't been yelling. Because apparently that's a problem. And I don't like yelling. Right. Red Forest is... Red, I guess. And blue. Right. Ooh, it's got some... It's got some words, this one. Right. Sorry, I was dancing there. I was, en I was enjoying the words. Nice. Meow. Oh, what? It made me do that. What? Oh, it, it like restarted me. That was not my fault. That was not my fault. Where did my where did my green stuff go? I liked my green stuff. Oh. Okay, let's go to the description. Right, SkyFi is a sit flight simulator where you can explore different biomes, collect objects, and go through levels accompanied by relaxing music. Well, that is true. That's all uh, fairly accurate. Um, the game costs three dollars eighty-nine or five dollars New Zealand. It's an early access. Okay. SkyFi, yeah, we saw that. You'll be able to pilot various airplanes with different characteristics, modes, and much more. On the final version of the game, you'll be able to play an authentic pro flight mode. Variety of airplanes, different maps to explore, collectible required for passing the level, beautiful landscape and texture. Oh, that's in Spanish, and that's in French. It's in French. Um... So, if we go and have a look at Blup Games, you can see that this is their only game. Um, however, we go look at the publisher, Back to Basics Gaming. Oh, there we go. So, yeah, they're they're responsible for Feminazi, the triggering Turbo Pug, which was also just... I don't understand why people like that game. That game, I did not enjoy Turbo Pug, like, at all. Um, what are some other games uh, that we've played of theirs? I, I've played a few. Super Mr. C Cake, we played that. Um, I'm one of two people to have reviewed it. Did not enjoy it. Um, Escape Machines, I played that. That game was awful. How does that have 399 reviews? Jeez, man, people are just gluttons. Stellar 2D, we played that. Yep, I remember. Man, this Back to Basics Gaming, they, they produce a lot of games. There's our Feminazi 3000. Neon Hardcore. Um, I can't remember. I, I must have said something about that. I don't actually remember that one. It was mediocre, if I don't remember it. Um, Nihilist Simulator is, is due... It was due already, but it's not here, so it didn't happen. Nihilist Simulator <laughs> made itself not happen. Clergy Explode, I remember being terrible. Ampersand was 
bad. That, that game crashed. I remember I couldn't even get it to run. Um, yeah. So, that's back to basics gaming. I'm not saying that this game is the same. Uh, it's not. You know, there's their little logo there. Um, this game is actually not bad, you know? It's probably a little bit expensive. Um, and as far as, like, different things in the, uh, the airplanes, I didn't, I didn't notice any differences in how the ampl the airplanes, uh, handled or anything. They all just sort of flew, you know? You can't control the throttle, you can't control the, um, you can't stop them, you can't land or anything, so there's no real, uh, there's no real control, and the maps are so small. If, the, if I was going to make one suggestion about any of this, it would be to make the maps bigger. The maps being as small as they are, you can tell. You know, you're in an airplane. You can fly up, and it just, like, is totally takes you out of the game. It's like, oh, look, the map is super, super tiny. It's not, not great. So that's my suggestion. Make the maps bigger, or at least make them look bigger and, like, Put, a, put an invisible wall in or something that like actually turns the plane so that we're not uh, having to restart every time we fly around. That would be my suggestion. Other than that, yeah, this is not bad. It's not bad. No, no I, would, um, I would say that I enjoyed my 15 minutes. It's not like compelling or anything. Um, but, you know, at a couple of bucks, I would definitely recommend it. For five bucks, I'd be like, ugh. It's a bit iffy. It's a bit iffy. But, you know, to each their own. Apparently there's some zebras in it. <laughs> Anyways, um, so that was SkyFi. Thanks for watching. Uh, make sure you like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Class dismissed.